I'm Sterling Jigwith. I help Catholic moms manage their brains. I'm going to tell you why you feel angry and guilty so often. Let's say you have two kids and they're fighting over a toy. Totally normal kid thing, but it feels super annoying. It's maddening when kids argue about toys. And so what you do is you resist what's happening. You think they shouldn't be fighting. And when you think they shouldn't be fighting, you feel angry. And when you feel angry inside your body, you're going to have a stress response. So you're going to yell at them. You're going to shame them. You're going to show up in a way that isn't the way that you like. So this is why we feel angry. Then we watch our reaction, right? You look above and you go, gosh, I did not show up the way that I wanted to. I was yelling. I was shaming them. And now you think, I'm a bad mom. And when you think you're a bad mom and you feel guilt, that's a hiding emotion. And so you're going to scroll on your phone. You're going to hide from your kids, maybe in your room. You're going to overeat, overdrink. And just in general, you're going to be disconnected from them. Let me show you what you should do instead. I have six kids and learning this significantly improved my ability to enjoy living in my own house with these six kids. So first of all, kids do what kids are going to do. They're going to bicker. They're going to fight. They're going to hit each other. I'm not saying that we just allow them to do that, but those are teachable moments. Kids doing that in in the first place is just completely normal. So when we have acceptance of that, then it allows us to think, okay, this is a great parenting moment. I was going to draw a cape for superhero mom, but I could not figure out how to do that. So you get a superhero mom crown instead. And when you think this is it, I'm up. This is my mom moment. Some version of that. You're going to feel purposeful. And then you're going to parent them in the way that you have decided you wanted to parent them, right? I would probably issue a calm consequence. I might teach them something. I might separate them. I would help everyone calm down. And then I might show them what we could do instead that was more aligned with our family values. And then watching myself do that, I would feel like a good mom, right? Watching myself show up the way that I want. There's no objective, this is the right way, but there is the way that you wanna show up. And so when I feel purposeful and I show up the way that I want, I think I'm a good mom. When you think you're a good mom, you will feel connected. You're gonna feel connected to your kids and you're gonna feel connected to yourself. So you're gonna problem solve from that place of connectedness. Like, hey, what do these kids need? Maybe they need to go outside. Maybe they need to eat something. And you're going to do the same thing for yourself. You're going to meet your own needs because you're feeling connected. So instead of being angry and then feeling guilt and then hiding, you're going to show up with love and connectedness. I have a coaching membership for Catholic moms and I teach them how to enjoy life with kids at home. Madeforgreatness.co. Come check it out.